I would give this uh, bread to the chickens, and somebody says, why do you give them bread to the chickens? I said, I'm pre-stuffing them, you know. <laughs> Just a joke. I know, we're not stuffing you. Farming is, uh, has always been tough. It's, it's a tough lifestyle. The only rewards you get is what we get right here with taking care of the animals. This part of Wisconsin is beautiful. People really will give you the shirt off their back, but it's also a very poor community. I had some heart issues almost a year ago. The doctor was worried right away. and She said, you're having a heart attack. She said, I'm calling the ambulance. And I said, no, don't call the ambulance. I said, we can't afford it. I couldn't sacrifice my farm for a ride to a doctor's. I, I choose my farm over my own life. They say in the state of Wisconsin, we lose a barn a month. It's cheaper to burn that barn down than it is to keep paying the property tax. I know President Trump ran on that he's gonna help the farmer, but he's not helping the farmer at all. In fact, it's even worse than it was before. I'm very proud of the fact that I was a lifelong Republican. At the age of 18, I've cast my vote in every election, Republican all the way. When you were raised poor, um, and just because we had food, we were farmers, so we always ate good. But our clothes were not good clothes. But we had a good education. And my mom and dad taught us right from wrong. I loved going and talking to people about my beliefs and um, things that I held true. But Trump took that away from me. My biggest regret is voting for that man. Biggest regret.